Harley. Hi, Harley. Hi, it's okay. Dad says you're such a gentle little soul. Hey, little girl. I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong, but I think you have fleas. Yeah, look at those matted legs. Yeah, hey, pretty girl. Mm -hmm. You ready to come out? All right, let's come. Let's get you on the table. What's going on YouTube and welcome back to my channel. If you've been here before, thank you for returning. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications so you are notified every single time I drop a video and you don't miss not one video. Everybody in here, smash that like button, share this video and drop a comment down below during the video, after the video, before the video, whatever you feel. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you like about the video. Let me know what you want to see next. You saw by the title and the thumbnail, we got a good one. So let's get straight into this groom also you guys make sure you're continuing to watch the ads I know some of them can be a little lengthy but watch them as much as you can for as long as you can it truly does help support the channel and support me it helps me to do this on a more full-time basis and it really does keep me out in the algorithm as I've been and keeps the channel growing I really appreciate it and love you guys let's get back into the groom Okay, so Miss Harley, Miss yeah, Miss Harley. The reason now I know you guys saw that she is matted, and the reason why I decided to bathe her first, as opposed to clippering her, is because I felt like she had fleas. That's just what I was gathering. It seemed like she had fleas. But, I mean, the dad said that she's dirty because she plays outside. But to be honest, it was giving fleas. It looked like she had fleas. But uh, from wetting her, she don't have, I don't see not one flea on her. Now, the reason why I don't see fleas yet and then why I'm determining she doesn't have fleas is because when you, once you wet a dog, the fleas automatically start to come out. But listen, don't be like, ah, 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 ah. Don't be like Hamilton. I have to wet your face. It's okay. Yeah, so when you first wet a dog, the fleas automatically come out. Nah, uh, 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 you're okay. You're okay. I'm trying not to get it in your nose. Yeah, okay, see, good girl. Good job. But no fleas crawl out once I wet her. So that leads me to believe that she doesn't have any. She is really just dirty like the dad said. So we're going to give her a nice good scrub. Let her soak. And blow her dry. And hopefully when I blow her out, some of the mats will loosen up and I'll be able to get a longer length, longer length under her mats. But we won't only only we'll only know once I start to look right in her. And she too has crusties all around her face. She has crusties all around her eyes too. Worse than Hamilton. Now she's not related to Hamilton. They're just here on the same day. Um, but I have to scrub her face like I do Hamilton's. And her face is shaped just like Hamilton. She uh, has a really close snout. And she smells so bad. So bad. She smells like she plays outside. She smells just it's gross. She smells gross. But we're going to make her smell good today. I might have to wash her face twice. I will probably wash her face twice.
Now the owner likes to keep her longer, but she cannot be long because she is really matted. So today she's going to be getting, she's going to be going pretty short. I wish I didn't have to shave her short because she would look so cute in a nice little fluffy cut. But there's nothing that I can do. So unfortunately she has to go and be shaved. I get a lot of comments that thank me for not shaving down every dog. I personally do not like shaving dogs. I like doing longer cuts on them. I think they look cuter longer, but a lot of owners can't maintain it. So they know that the dog has to be shaved short. He, on the other hand, he would prefer her longer. But again, like I said, can't do that. The amount of mats she has as much like where they're located, the type of matting it is, it would not be wise to demat her. It would just really irritate her skin. Like I know what dogs I can demat and what I can't, and she's a dog that I cannot demat, so I will not be dematting her. I'm actually going to rinse her, wash her again, and then let that soak. Because she's really dirty. And she smells really bad. I'm going to wash. She's not going to get rid of her smell. So, I'm going to rinse her. And we're going to wash her again. And I'm only going to let her soak for a couple of minutes because she doesn't need to soak long. Listen, girl. 
Carly Settlement. No, Carly, no. No Carly. mats away from her ear so they're not as tight when I shave them out because her ears do have to be shaved her matting is too tight unless I can blow it loose but I'm pretty sure her ears have to be shaved so it's just too much I know he ain't gonna like the other one. He's gonna be just like Hamilton. Just like Hamilton. That actually was pretty easy. That's because you got bigger eyes than Hamilton. When you are washing a matted dog, you really gotta scrub them and work the soap into those mats. And that's how ultimately you get the mats loosened up because mats are really just a bunch of dirty fur, oily, greasy fur clumped together. So, and for those wondering if washing a matted dog will make them worse, it will if you let it sit, if you let them air dry, but you can blow them straight through and loosen the mats. Nine times out of 10 it works. There's only a very few times that I've washed the dog and they're matted and it didn't loosen up much and I mean like a handful less than a handful of times that's not to say let your dog get matted and we can wash it and it'll loosen up don't do that don't come to us with that nonsense don't do that and don't say I said you could do it because I didn't Hamilton's back there having a fit, smacking his little paw on the cage. He is really on one today. Maybe, maybe his eye just bothered him and that's why he's tripping.
I can feel that the mats are not as tight. So I'm glad I washed her first. And if I feel like a dog has fleas, or if I know a dog has fleas, I'm always going to wash them first because I actually do not like free shaving dogs that have fleas. I think it is so gross. And I got too many dogs to take home fleas, so... Yeah, I can definitely feel the mat loosening up now. Uh-uh, put your foot down. I didn't told you about that. You have poop in yourself. Look nasty. For her ears, usually I, if there's a mat in the ear, I'll brush that out first before I wash them. But her, the matting around her ears were to a point where I felt like if I tried to brush them out before her bath, it would not have done anything but irritate her ears. So sometimes it's better to wash them because once the ear is getting clean and once the fur is getting clean, not the ear with the fur, once the fur is getting clean, you can kind of peel apart the matting. Girl, you smell so much better. Ooh, you just think it. So that's why y'all saw me kind of pulling and separating it, the mat on the ear. Like, it feels better. A lot better. I still might have to shave it. I don't know. But it helps. Relieve the pressure from the ear. Oh, here we go. We don't like this. It helps relieve the pressure from the head down from the ear. So that if I shave it, she's less likely to get a beat from And also, rinsing the ears in cold water helps the circulation as well when you're separating the mats. Uh-uh, uh-uh. No, we're not what's this? Didn't I say we weren't doing all of that? I don't care how tiny you are, we ain't doing that. No. I said no. I don't know why you keep trying. It don't never work out for you. You get on dogs sometimes. I wonder. I just wonder. Oh, oh. Yeah. I know you don't like it in your eyes, but oh, good man, that's what's so Nope, nope. Ah, ah, ah. Still. All right, pure rinse. Shake it off. Also, washing them twice kind of helps them dry faster. <laughs> now, given how she just acted for rinsing her face, I know for a fact drying her face is going to be a hassle. So, <laughs> prepare yourselves, you guys. Just prepare. dry you in a tub because you have mats and the dryer over here is better for separating them.
okay, okay. Well, that makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah, so, yep, I have her on the table now. Um, I am, I do have to take her down to the shortest one. I did, I was able to loosen up the mats, but not loose enough where I was able to get her to do a longer blade. I think it would be too much to try and force that blade through, and I want to be very careful. So, she'll be in a seven blade, but it'll grow back in all evenly, and then I'll do a little cute face on her. But I do have to shave her ears. All right. All right, I'll give you a 15-minute call before she is done. Um, I did have somebody stop in where I had to make an appointment, and the phone did ring. So she should be done around 2.30, but I will give you a 10-minute window. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, cool. All right. No problem. Bye. Sorry, guys. I had to talk to the owner over the phone about a couple things. So I am shaving her in a seven blade. A seven blade. Because I don't think anything else will get through her mats. And I think that is the safest blade to take on her. Now, in terms of the rest of her, I don't know what I'm going to do on her face. Probably a short little teddy bear face considering I have to shave her ears. When you, when you have to shave ears, doing anything longer on their face than something that's proportioned to the ears in their body is going to look weird. <laughs> so, her face will be a little short teddy bear face. Okay, let's get these mats off you. What I've noticed about people who have dogs that are matted like this, a lot of them don't really know that their dog... G give me the tail. A lot of them don't know that their dogs are matted the way they are. Because he didn't know that she was this matted. I don't know if he knows what matting is. But he said he felt her ears and he knew what her ears felt. I need to hold this tail and not you swerve it all over the place. He said he felt her ears and he knows what her ears felt like. But I think because she's an outside dog, she likes to go in the creek. I think that is why she gets all mad at. And then also, like I think I stated earlier, maybe not. He washes her at home every two weeks. He washes her at home every two weeks. And he, like, partially dries her. He said he does not get her, like, all the way completely dry. And I let him know that that is what's matting her up as well. So I know he got upset with another groomer for shaving her. But I informed him that she was going to be shaved again today. And so were her ears. So he is very much aware. Well, a lot of people don't know what matting is. 
so when their dog gets mad it they don't know how to look for it one customer I had up north I showed her exactly what matting was what it looked like and she would bring him in oh he looks great today Brittany you shouldn't have any issues and he she was right he looked great no issues and then she knew when he was mad she'd be like Brittany you have to shave him again he matted so some people take heed to it like she did and other people do not so And for dogs that are skinny like this, you got to be real careful shaving them down because their skin is loose. It moves around. Ah, ah, ah. So you got to go real slow when you're shaving a dog like this. Come on. And you especially want to go gentle right there because this part can easily catch inside the blade. It's happened to me before. No, I need your little foot.
The next moment I don't. Alrighty, let's do your paw pads, mama. Because I want to get her paw pads before I do the guard comb. So the blade stays cool. And I'm doing her paw pads in a 30 blade. I don't take my, my guard comb with you now. Oh, where are you going? She is trying to move her tail in the way. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, we almost done with you, little flipper. All right, so we're gonna do three eighths on her head, 10 millimeters. Because again, I have to shave her head, shave her ears, not her head. She has a cowlick here because of the bald spot. So it grows differently there. I'll be able to clean that up with a thinning shears.
You got some big old eyes, girl. Mm, well. All right. Now, let's do everything else. Grab my tin blade. Do her sanitary first. Oh, your tail is so long. Usually I go the opposite way, but I couldn't find it the opposite way when I'm saving the sanitary. So, and she's all matted. Hold on, girl. Okay, hold on. Come on, scooch a little bit more on the table. Ow, that tail is a mess. Alrighty, time to get rid of the ears. That sucks, but yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do them. Hold on, let me see something. I'm gonna shave the inside of the ears first to see if I can get the outside a longer length. I probably won't because of the matting, but I'm gonna try. I like to try. No. And then I'll do a longer blade on the outside of her ears. Well, I will try to do a longer blade on the outside of her ears. I don't know if I can. Uh oh, my bad. Smacked y'all with the clippers. And this little trick I was taught by one of my old co workers up north. Oops. Hit y'all with the clippers again. I'm sorry. I'm probably dizzy. If you shave the insides of the ears to separate the mat from... It's okay. To separate the mat from the inside of the ear, you more than likely can get a longer blade on the outside of the ear. So, that's what I'm going to try and do. Let's try a four on the outside of the ears. Don't think it's gonna go through, but we're gonna try. Mm. 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Ooh, sucky, sucky. We got the full through. Come through. Blessings. All right, hold on. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let's see if we can get it on this air. This air is a little bit more difficult. Oh, suck it, suck it. We might have to get the 10 back there. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Yeah, we might have to do a 10 back. Actually, no, we could just swap to the 7. Since that's cooled down. Oh, you got naked ears, girl. Look, look at God. Won't he do it? Look at, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have to shave your beard and um maybe a four blade. Cause uh you got some things going on up under there. You got some mats going on. People, do not walk in the grooming salon when your dog is on the table, okay? Do not do that. All right. We got all that. Let's get your eyes. Come here. Stay still. Stay still. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. I didn't think it's going like that one. Come here. Well, no. I have to get this. Well, I can see why this is so long. You don't let nobody get it. Nope. I have to because it's all matted. Good girl. Good girl. See? Good job. See? We got that. We got that. No. I got to get the other side. And you got big eyes, so you got to you gotta stay still. That's not something you can just move around for, okay? Good job. Good job. Good girl. Good girl. Good job, Harley. Ah, 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 ah. You're doing good. You're doing really good. I wonder if you're named after Harley Davidson. The motorcycle. He seems like a motorcycle man. Yeah, your dad seems like a motorcycle guy. So... That one, come on, because you got one on the other side. You got rocks. And I need all of them. I hate shaving dogs down this short, but Lord, she was a mess. You got something else here I gotta get. Child, we gonna do the best with you. The best that we can. This tail ain't about to stay this long, that's for sure. It's matted and stringy. Oh, it looks a mess. Oh, I don't like when people come in while I'm working. Do not make me feel rushed. I don't like that. No groomer likes to feel rushed, you guys. Especially if we're working with a dog that doesn't like their face being messed with or a dog that's sensitive and we have to take our time with the dog. 
And if you're, especially if your dog is matted, that's on top of it, top of everything. Especially if your dog is matted. all these mats in your tail. That tail is <laughs> entirely too long, so we're going to cut it off. So this is the tailbone. Bring it down here. reason why I'm not cutting it any shorter is because I don't oh sorry girly I don't feel like they want her to cut any shorter than that all right now we're gonna do your nails and scissor you up and you're done girl yeah let's see how you do for your nails I'm not gonna fight you on your nails so if you don't like the grinding we will clip them good girl Ah, 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 ah. You have nails like puppies. Other side. No.
Now I'm probably gonna do her face first before I scissor her feet just in case her dad walks back in. All right, so now I'm gonna go. So now I'm gonna go through and scissor her face, and then finish her ears by getting all the stranded hair so it looks even. And then I'll get all that with the thinning shears. I'm sorry. All right. All right. Just wanted to see if you'll let me pluck it. I didn't think you would. You don't seem like a let me pluck it type. Eh, watch it. Child, almost got your ear. Gotta be careful. Yeah, where she has that bald spot, it grows almost in like a circle. So it's kind of hard to make that look neat because of how it grows. Hold on. Now, I don't know if she's going to let me get all of this. I'm going to try. Put that in there. Something tells me she ain't. I didn't think she was going to give it up without a fight. 
Come on, give me that lip hair. You don't need it. There you go. I ain't think she's gonna get that up without a fight. Most dogs don't like the sensation on their mouth. Sorry guys, I'll start saying something and then I'll zone back into the groom. Completely forget what I was gonna say. You're so naked, but you know what? By the time Thanksgiving come, your hair should look real cute. You should grow out into a pretty little girl. I mean, you're pretty now, but you know what I mean. A little fluff. Give me this face, girl. Look at this long mess down here. Just more stuff you don't need. You gonna let me get this a little bit more? Probably not. Good girl. Ah, no, 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 no. I have to get it Stay. Stay, please, please. No, that is your eyeball, you silly dog. No, you gotta get it done. There, I got it. I got it already, it's too late. I took it. <sighs> Look at your little tiny face. All right, let's scissor your feet and everything and you're done. This should be a piece of cake, long as you let it.
Stop with the feet. Come on, let's get the other feet. Make sure you guys smash that like button, share this video, drop a comment down below, do all that fancy YouTube stuff. I love you guys. Train your dogs for grooming. Make sure you watch every video straight through. Watch those ads. Enjoy the videos. I'll catch you in the next one. Love you guys.